I remember waking up one summer morning in 2008 um, in my home village, Ergeg, and turning on the water tap to find not a single drop. A few hours later, we discovered that the village well had dried up. People panicked. The only way to get water was to beg large farm owners for a bucket. I felt so sad and helpless to see my community struggling to get water for their families and cattle. Can you imagine that this situation lasted for three burning summer months, including Ramadan? My name is Mahdi Lafran, and my path to become an environmental activist started in a tiny village in southwest Morocco, where I was born to a family of farmers. I grew up around trees, plants, and animals. As a child, I helped my father with his agricultural work. I used to uh, do cow milking, um, ride, um, drive a um, farm tractor, or um, sheep herding. But um, over the last 10 years, I witnessed how environmental change threatens this community. Fast forward, and I had become a city boy studying business in an urban center nearby. During my third year at university, I got involved with a local nonprofit called Dar Sihmad. Dar Sihmad runs this innovative project that turns, that turns fog to potable water and distributes it to more than 500 villagers in southwest Morocco who were previously without access to water. When I first talked with my parents about this project, they were confused and didn't believe me until they saw how it worked on TV. You know, anything on TV is legit, right? Um, they were impressed and also proud of their son who finally got involved with something related to the family business. In the meanwhile, <laughs> I was also proud that they finally got to completely understand for once what I was doing with my life. At Dar Sihmad, along with a stellar team of Moroccan and American young people, we started the Environmental Youth Ambassadors Project, the EYA. The EYA is an environmental education and media advocacy program for young people. I was so excited about this project because it combined my, my interests in technology, sustainability, and volunteering. At Dar Sihmad, um, along with an amazing team, we organized numerous environmental awareness events, teaching children in rural areas about water and sustainability, and mobilizing other youth to join us in taking action. We reached out to thousands of people by producing multimedia content in five languages to promote the cause on the platform millennials use the most, social media. The best part of this experience was working with rural children and teaching them about water and natural ecosystems. As someone who was born and raised in a, in a small village, in a remote village in southwest Morocco, I saw myself in each one of them and was proud to contribute just a little bit to ensuring a resilient future for them and their families. My team and I were honored to present our work at the UN Climate Change Summit last November in Marrakesh, um, and also to join the global discussion on sustainable development. I truly believe that environmental activism is a team sport. Every single contribution can make us move forward in protecting our planet and ensuring a bright future for coming generations. Although considerable amounts of work have been done in the past, we need to do more. We need to act as soon as possible as individuals, organizations, and governments. Right now, environmental issues are endangering my family's and village's way of life. My two best friends' families, for example, put an end to their farms simply because they run out of water. In the future, many families will face the same issues. We are all victims of climate change. By working together as young people from around the world, we can tackle environmental concerns. Together, we can find innovative solutions for resilience, adaptation, and empowerment. Together, we can prevent my village from turning into a desert. But only if you're willing to join me. I hope you will. I hope you will. I hope, I hope you will. Because if you don't, millions around the world may lose their homes, their heritage, and even their lives. 
but together we can take real action for positive global change. Thank you very much.